In this video, I'm going to create a simple calculator using Qt Creator. First, I will create two numbers using line edit. Then, I will use push button to perform multiplication, division, subtraction and addition. Then finally, the result will be displayed in using label. Let's see how to do this in Qt. First, create a Qt widget application like this. Make it as simple calculator. Go to form. Create push button. Name it as plus. Create multiple copies. Name it as minus division and multiplication. The purpose of this task is to get an idea about line edit, push button and label. Now create a line edit. This should be number one. Create an another copy and this should be line, line edit two and line edit two is nothing but number two. Now create a label. Change the background color of label using style sheet. Make background color as white. So that we can easily differentiate label and line edit. Now I'm going to rearrange all these uh, buttons like push button, line edit and label. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to get two numbers using line edit. Then the push buttons plus minus division multiplication will be used to perform the respective operation. Then the result will be displayed in label. Create an another label and align it with line edit one. So number one is nothing but line edit. Number two is nothing but line edit. So you can use label to differentiate line edits. Then the result will be displayed in white color background label. Now run the application. You can see the front end. But whenever you push the buttons, push button, nothing will work because we didn't write any code so far on this button. So next, I'm going to write code inside that button. Go to main window. You can see the code now. Go to form, select line edit, select text changed. You can see a function for text changed. So I'm going to convert that argument into float again. Select select in line edit go to slot select text changed you will get a window like this so number two will be argument to float then define float as number one number two in global variable so that you can assess that variable inside any function also create another variable name result that should be equal to zero initially now click on plus button Go to slot, select clicked, then 
do the same process for the remaining borders. Select division, go to slot, click, you will get a function. Now I'm going to do some mathematical process inside addition. So number one plus number two, that will be stored in result. Then I will display the result in label. For that, the command is UI label set text result. Here the result is number. So type Q string to number. So this is a conversion of result. So whenever you push plus button, then addition of two number will be displayed in label. Copy the code, paste inside the push button two, three and four. Now in push button two, change plus as minus. In push button three, change plus as multiplication. In push button four, change plus as division. Now run the simple calculator. You will get a window like this number one three number two four plus will give seven minus will give minus one division will give 12 sorry will give 12. now make number one as two number two as two plus will give four minus will give zero multiplication will give four division will give one so this is how the simple calculator will work and this is the code for simple calculator.